I put this video together uh, for five minutes and six seconds. I'm going to show you how to install stair railing in uh, six steps. Step one, you prepare the floor and you determine where the, the uh, post of the railings are going to be. For this particular stair setup, uh, we're going to use three uh, posts. If you look closely at the bottom of the post, they had to be cut uh, to fit uh, depending on the floor. So step three was the um, installing of the rails. Please use a leveler to level off um, the uh, railing. And the blue tape that you see on the bottom, it, uh, you know, once you determine the spacing between the balusters or spindles, uh, you know, you mark them because uh, what we're going to do later is um, we're going to drill holes to uh, for on the rail, on the bottom side of the rail, and as well as on the uh, blue uh, tape that we marked off with pencil where the uh, baluster is going to be. If you look close enough, uh, you could see the marking. We had our uh, uh, bolsters three inches apart. So now we have all the three railing installed in place. We uh, are going to go ahead and start drilling the uh, positions that we marked already for the uh, balusters. As you can see, the holes in the bottom of the railing they don't come that way. We had to drill them uh, after installing the baluster. Uh, uh, I mean, after installing the uh, railing, we, we, we had to make those holes. They are not pre-drilled uh, before installation. So we installed the uh, railing and then we made the holes on the bottom and on top. Once we get that installed, now we are ready to uh, install the balusters. Um, you know, once you have the uh, size of the baluster that's going to go there, determine and you just uh, cut in um, in size and you just install them. Uh, on the stairway, there's two sizes because the stair is going down. So uh, and and if you look one. One, the one closest to the next stair is a little taller than the other one. So you want to be mindful of that. On the floor, the, uh, all the balusters are the same size. Only the stairway have two different sizes. So um, these balusters were nailed on top with a nail gun and then glue. We glued them together. Once done, you admire. Uh, the work. I hope uh, you like, uh, enjoy the video. Uh, please, if you find it useful, subscribe to my channel, uh, share it with your family and friends, and don't forget to uh, like the video as well. Thank you for watching. Uh, what I wanted to show you before I go is the uh, mounting uh, screws that were used for the um, for the post, I'm going to show you later on. These are the nails um, that that's in place for the uh, with the nail gun, and then on the bottom, you have, you see as you can see two nails there, but it doesn't look that good, so we decided to uh, not nail the bottom, so just glue them. The glue should be strong enough to hold in place. The glue we used is um, Elmer's uh, wood glue. All the other um, Balusters on top got nailed in place. If you look at the cut up over here, almost half of this post uh, on the bottom we uh, had to cut up to fit in place with the shape of the floor. Where the post went, the uh, floors also had to be cut. And those are the mounting holes. For the uh, post. If you look closely, you could see the floor had to also had to be cut to in 
to have the post in position.